Hello there, my name is Chris Palmer. In today's Google Maps SEO optimization video, I wanna go ahead and share with you ways that you can start getting the Google Maps enhancement of their website mentions. If you've ever seen inside of Google Maps, underneath where the reviews and the name is, you'll see either reviews, this that'll share a review, or it will also share with you their website mentions. Now, a lot of times people want to know, well, where is this information pulled from? But more importantly, if we can start to understand where Google is pulling from or what Google is reading in order to show an enhancement, then we can know for sure what it takes in order to optimize for higher rankings and to get more traffic from GMB and Google Maps. So I don't want to waste any time. Let me go ahead and walk you through exactly how you can start getting these enhancements and what Google is looking at. Now, I've actually went ahead and made a brief list here of what Google is looking at uh, as far as getting this particular GMB or Google Maps enhancement. Now, what I'll do is I wanna walk you, I'll go through the list in briefly here, and then I'll go ahead and share with you some examples so you can get a deeper understanding. Again, the reason why it's not necessarily getting the enhancement, that's not the point of the video. The point is I wanna share with you, yes, I wanna give you that information, but I. I want you to start understanding what Google is looking at and why and how far they go, like what's important to them. This can help with your rankings. So let's not waste any more time. Let me get into it. Number one is the importance of the homepage. I cannot stress enough the correlation that Google is reading what's on the homepage. Everything starts from the homepage. It's all about the homepage and having that optimized and being spot on. Number two, the order of the words. So getting these things to showcase, regardless of the order, regardless of where they're at, there could be a word in the heading, there could be a word mixed up, it could be backwards, irrelevant of the order, does not matter. Number three, it, it's playing on to all the other stuff. It has to be on the homepage. Um, the co-occurring keywords. So co-occurring means relevant. Relevant terms are also called LSI terms, it's co-occurring keywords. These are words often talked about when talking about a particular topic. Optimization is utilizing the keyword over and over and over again. Like if I'm a plumber, 24 hour plumber, I need to have 24 hour plumber the right amount of times to be optimized. But I need to talk about wrenches and water and heaters and all that stuff the right amount of times in order to be the most relevant. So co-occurring keywords matter the most especially when we're talking about GMB and Google Maps and especially when we're talking about your homepage. Why? Because I'm going to explain that to you. Google puts importance on relevance, aka for SEOs like us, they put importance on LSI or co-occurring keywords. All right, so number four, everything 99% of the times originates from the body. So to answer the big question of where are they pulling these details, they're pulling it from the body. Yes, there's some instances of where it's in the heading. There's also instances if you read number two, order doesn't matter. They're going to pull one word, two word, three word. They'll put them together and say, hey, the site mentions this. Also, if the word is SEO experts, it could just say expert and they'll just put two and two together and say, hey, you're, you're, you're in there. <laughs> All right. Number four or number five, I mean, embeds. Again, things are originated from the body. Things are also originated from within the homepage, but Google is reading the embeds. They will take it. If it's on the homepage, they will see what's there and follow that through like a link and see what, what everything is and they will read it. Okay. So let's go ahead and walk through these. Let me give you some examples, importance of homepage. All right. Now, every single example, everything, and you can go look for yourself, everything originates from the homepage. As we're going through, I'll go ahead and prove this point as we're going through. Uh, that's basically what I'm, I'm we're going to go through and give examples. That's like proof. Um, so number two, which I'll do as we go through. Number two is order of words does not matter. So let me let me get, bring you over here. Uh, as far as the order, if you come on into... Um, Oh my goodness. If you come on into a uh, real estate agent 
Tampa. Okay, we'll just come on into here. What you'll be able to see is, or wait, that's wrong section. <laughs> the order, the order doesn't matter. If we go to SEO expert, okay, New York. All right. You'll be able to see if we come over here to this listing. And again, I don't know who these are. Um, and, and they're not in any particular order. I'm just going through them as we see here. So the order, all right. So the website mentions, the website mentions SEO expert. So if we do a control F and we go SEO expert, okay. SEO expert, SEO expert. This is all within the body content. So I guess that proves that part of it. There's also an embed here, which is quite interesting if you take a look at the embed if you zoom in it says SEO expert that's just another tidbit um, as we scroll on down here uh, again SEO expert it's in the body content so I guess that takes care of that one let's do um, real estate or let's do um, digital marketing experts New York, okay. We'll go back to the order. All right, so let's take a look for um, their website mentions digital marketing experts. So this will take care of the order um, of the website. So if we do digital marketing experts, if you take a look here, um, where is it? Let's scroll on down here. So we'll do control F and we'll do, uh, let's do marketing digital let's look for the word expert watch this so expert so as you can see expert digital marketing right so digital marketing experts okay so the order doesn't matter also they've taken away the s because they have only were used the word experts or expert one time on the page so it doesn't matter the placement it doesn't matter the order They'll pull and match like, hey, this is a relevant search phrase. For, you were searching for this. This is relevant for this. It mentions it on the page. We'll put, we'll even put it together for them. <laughs> Very interesting. So that takes care of the order. Also the embeds, I'll share another embed with you in a moment here. So co-occurring keywords matter the most. Now we know this because when Google, when you come in here and you're searching for reviews, and I know we're talking about website mentions, but just to show you how much it matters to Google is when you look for any business, any business at all. So let's just do uh, SEO expert New York, okay? So we're, we'll just stay with that SEO expert. When you come inside of here, let's just say we go to this guy, I don't know who he is, I don't know this website, so uh, I'm very sorry. If you come inside of here and you go to reviews, as you can see, they're being showcased and sorted by, and they're started with and sorted by most, by most relevant. Again, optimization is using the primaries and secondaries the right amount of times. Uh, relevance comes from, or LSI comes from, utilizing the words that often come up the right amount of times. That's optimization, or that's <laughs> relevance, all right? So let's keep moving on here. Uh, let's move on to the next um example here so it comes from the body and heading and so far as you've gone through here i've gone over number one that everything has been initiated from the home page all right so four comes from the body and headings the most as you can see that like from the last example it doesn't matter the order but again it was the home page the first example again was the home page um, the other piece was I, I just wanted to cover relevance that's why I showed you the reviews and how they're sorted what's most relevant that also gives you an insight of what words for your keywords are considered most relevant that helps you uh, when curating reviews as a side uh, piece of information on top of that comes from the body and heading tag so no matter what we do is if, if we go to um, SEO let's just do expert Miami Miami okay we'll just do two examples here this is to show that it's, it's going to be the home page and generally from the body all right so if we just scroll down here um, SEO expert Miami 
So let's go back out here to Google Maps. Actually, not here. We'll go to Google Maps. So let's just do SEO Expert Miami. And yeah, I went to a lot of the bigger cities just to make things simple. But if you take a look here, we'll go to this website here. Uh, we'll go to the website. Okay. And let's just find another one here. Uh, website mentions. Website mentions. Their website mentions search engine optimization expert. So we'll come over here. All right. So let's come to here first. So what did they say that this site is saying is SEO expert Miami. So again, we're landed onto the home page. We're going to go control F and it's SEO expert Miami. See again, there's no order, but it was mentioned on the page. The page is mentioning Miami, as you can see inside of the headings, of course, and also within the body, of course, that makes perfect sense, but it doesn't have to be in order. It's initiated from the body. All right. And Google's doing it for you. Let me give you one more example. So here's the Miami SEO guy again. Uh, this is not the home page, so that's quite interesting. So let's come back over here. Um, but this isn't the most relevant result. This guy is actually in Cleveland. It's just their website mentions. This is not a relevant result for SEO expert Miami. So I will take that out, but they did have a Miami page. So that's quite interesting. However, I did say that it is normally going to be initiated from the homepage, but they will crawl and go to another page. Let me go ahead and showcase that for you. All right, because that does make sense, but usually 90% of the time it's going to be initiated from the homepage, always. But that was a, a good example to show, hey, they will go, but it's not relevant for this search result. They're just pulling out words because they didn't have enough results for that search term, right? I did SEO expert Miami. They're, they're pulling guys in Cleveland. <laughs> Like there must not be a lot of relevant results going on here, but I digress. Let's keep moving on here. Uh, the next piece is I want to go ahead and share with you the, how I know that the embeds AKA two that they're going to go to another page is I'll show you another type of example, which actually comes from, um, which actually comes from window installation, Virginia. Yep. So let's do this one. I'll go ahead and show you this. This was a, I worked on this in the past long, a while back. Um, we, we no longer work with this particular company, but they are implementing one of our strategies. If you take a look at their website and we come down into here, we click on this, as you can see, they are coming over to a PDF, which is just based off of a link, but it starts on the homepage. All right. It's the same thing. They are reading this stuff. All right, so let's keep moving on here. I just wanted to share with you that example and let's go down the list here and then embeds. That wasn't an embed. That's a link that goes over, but they will go to another page as long as it's relevant and it's linked from the home page. But let's, let's keep moving here. We're going to show the embeds now. So let me share with you an embed, um, SEO expert, um, embeds in the body. Yeah. So embeds in the body. So let's just do, um, I don't know, SEO expert, New York. Um, so let, their website mentions, uh, I think I already showed an embed to be honest with you, uh, but we'll do one more. I don't know if I have any off the top. So, um, oh, here's, here's another, here's an example. I, I shared this before. Um, let's just do locksmith. Denver just to show that they're reading the embeds and you could get these enhancements to trigger based on embed. Um, is there any here for this? Uh, I'll just go to the number. I'll just go to this one to showcase this. So we'll come over here. All right. Just to show that they're reading embeds um, and you come on down. Um, this is a slider. This is like an embed in a way. Uh, but that's not the one that I wanted to show. Not by any stretch of the imagination. Let's just go to one more here. And I don't want this to be too long, so I'm going to have to cut this section out. So that stinks. Um, uh, uh, SEO expert New York. Let's just go back to this page. Okay. Um, their website mentions. So we'll go over here to the website. 
Um, I noticed that they have the embed that says SEO expert over here. And they had another embed down in here, I believe. Yep, inside of here. So this is a clutch embed where they're reading it. I went through here and I saw um, SEO expert. It wasn't even for their result, but it's inside their page embedded, which makes perfect sense. I'm sure you guys realize that they're reading the embed. So it makes perfect sense and it's not that big of an issue. And then on top of that, of course, they have these down in here, which is always fun. These are very, very helpful, these map embeds. Um, there, I would probably do it a little bit differently. And uh, with that being said, this is the list for the website mentions. All right, the importance of the home page. The order doesn't matter. Uh, Co-occurring keywords are more important than the actual optimization keywords. If we can utilize more of those, we're able to show up for more. We're able to just show up more. Um, embeds are being read. You can get enhancements from them. The words in there are being counted. On top of that, um, comes generally these details initiate in the home page, and the reading stuff generally, like when you see them, they're coming from the body content on the home page. Now, with that being said, if there is a relevant anchor text or an anchor text going from the home page to an internal page containing a co-occurring keyword or a primary keyword going to an internal page, much like that Cleveland guy, right? So his, his website probably talks about SEO and being an SEO expert. One of those pages from the home page clicks over to the Miami page it works. It'll show an enhancement in the SERP. All right. So with that being said, that wraps up today's video. That's going to, that's going to showcase and give you not only ways to understand Google a little better for more traffic, more rankings, more traffic, more business, more leads, but it's also a way that you can get your website mentions to get that enhancement inside the SERP. So my name is Chris Palmer. If you have future questions related to Google Maps or how you can get enhancements or get more traffic, get higher rankings, anything, feel free, ask in the comments below. And I always look forward to seeing you in the next Google My Business SEO optimization how to get enhancements video. I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.